Hi everyone, so I hope you guys are having a great morning. I know it's only 6.57 in the morning, but that's the time. I usually wake up at about 5.30. Uh, the bus isn't picking me up though, because we have a two hour delay. I don't know why. I mean, it's April. Come on. It snowed out last night, that's why. But, that's not what this video is about. This video is about my makeup collection and how I store it. So, let's just get right into it. Um. Before I begin, I just want to say it's going to be really weird because I'm actually recording this on my laptop. And because yesterday I dropped my camera down the steps and this whole entire screen shattered. So, right now, there's a warranty on it though. So, I am bringing it to Best Buy today and then I should have a new one shipped in within two weeks. So, yeah, let's just begin. So, this is where I keep and store all my makeup. I have... Yeah, this is really weird to film on. Okay, I have, up there, I have, okay, so up here, all I have is, you guys, okay, yeah, okay, this is all my jewelry and stuff, well, most of it, and I have my Wonderstruck stuff, I like to put that up there, and then over here, I have, like, 50 Bath and Body Works hand sanitizers, and then for the next show, <coughs> I have... In here, I have two compact mirrors and two um, nail filing or nail kit manicure set. In here, in here, I have ah, I have six of my EOS. Um, I actually have seven, but one's in my school bag. In here, I just have my mini makeup kit, which I know I've done a review on, so check that video out. <coughs> Um, then next I have two e.l.f. palettes, and I don't know what these are called, other than I know that this is called the Cool Palette, and I've also shown this off in my makeup haul, or in one of my mall hauls, um, so there's that one, and then this one, I lost the sticker, but I'm pretty sure that it was the warm one. Or no, it was the naturals. And it just looks like that. And like I said, I do not have that much makeup. Like, I watched tons and tons of makeup collection videos, and these girls have too much makeup. Um, <clears throat> I have an e.l.f. Glitter Eye Beauty book. I love e.l.f. And it just looks like that. The phone's going off, sorry. It was a reminder for me to get out to the bus, but I don't ride the bus today. Because we have a two-hour delay. And then I have this one, which is just the 100-piece palette. And again, I have no idea what this is called. I'm pretty sure this is the spring one, though. And I dropped this, and it cracked. And so, yeah. Oh, no, I actually bought that like that. Yeah, I bought it like that. Okay. So, like I said, I do not have a lot of palettes, but this is the grand palette. And I don't know... Okay, so first, you pull out this drawer, and there's brushes in it, and it's from Profusion, which I have no idea where my mom got it, but, yeah. And then, then inside, I love it so much. I don't know how many eyeshadows there is, I haven't counted, and then there's like 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12 lip glosses, and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, um, well, there's 3 blushes, 2 concealers, and like 1 bronzer. And that's just what it looks like. It's all of these colors are not matte whatsoever. They are all like very, 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 very uh, sparkly. And um, if I'll let you look at these colors. And if you want me to do a tutorial with one of them or with this entire thing, obviously not with all the colors, but because there's like blues and greens. So if you just comment below like a blue or a green or a pink, there's even some really cute uh, coral colors. Yeah, there's that. And then, on to the next row. Down here, I just have most of my perfumes, like the Bath & Body Works ones. I have Secret Wonderland, and then the newer ones. I have Paris Amour, Pink Chiffon. Ooh, I love this smell so much, Be Enchanted. I just got it, like, a week ago. And I'm sorry if you guys can hear what's going on outside. I live by a really, really, really busy road. And when it's all, like, slushy and stuff outside... 
you hear like the tr giant trucks come by, and they have the Twilight Woods, and they have another big sh pink chiffon, an axe for her, and a uh, Victoria's Secret one. And up here, I have another sweet pea. Uh, sweet pea. I have this, which is from Claire's. I think I see it. Yeah. I don't have a lot of these caps. I have this one, which I have not. Uh, oh, Clinique. Do, 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 do. I have this, which I think I got as a dollar bin at like Shopco. And then I just got a pink uh, Shimmer and Shine in Party and Pier. Well, sorry. <laughs> and then in here I have all my deodorant and, which is kind of weird to show off, I guess. But then my lotions. So I have like these, which I got five of these last summer. They're just the uh, shimmering body body cream and wi uh, wild apple apple daffodil. And so now I only have two of those left. There's another one. And I got another. Whoa. And then I got another shimmering body cream in pink chiffon. And then I have a butterfly flower, which I don't know if I mentioned this in my March favorites. But I know I mentioned it somewhere. I think I mentioned it in my Bath and Body Works haul, but I love this so much. Uh, the Cashmere Glow, which I actually haven't used, so, yeah. I don't really like the smell. So, I think when I do my upcoming giveaway for my birthday, this is going to be in it. Um, then I just have, okay, this is what I'm really confused on. So, I bought this. I know I mentioned this in my newest Bath and Body Works haul, like, a week ago. I also have this. Look at the size of them, like, like, this is the travel size, and what is this, like, the travel travel size? Here, I'll show you them from the back. Like, ah, my computer. Okay. So, like, the different sizes, this one has <coughs> two fluid ounces, and this has three fluid ounces. So, I don't know whether they changed it or not. I'll show you my deodorant, I guess. I have the Lady Speed Stick, and... The secret, uh, so very summer berry. And then I also have a couple more, but I don't know where they went. So let me just quick put these back. And I will show you the next thing. Okay, so I don't know if you guys can tell, but. Yeah, you can't. Otherwise, I'll have to like close my computer completely. And down here, this is just all my uh, makeup cases, and I got like I have tons more. It's just I need to clean up my room and find them. Okay, now we're going up again. Okay, and then the next thing that I put on my makeup is right in here, and this is just a vanity that my mom had found at Big Lots, and it comes with a vanity chair. Hi, you can see my phone. And so, yeah, I don't really know where to start, but I guess we'll start over here. <coughs> you guys see that all right? Okie dokie. So, wait a minute. I'm trying to figure out best angles for these. <laughs> okay, yeah, right here. Okay, so in here, I just have, I have headbands in that, and then I have just like, so these are like the headbands that like I'm wearing right now, but these are just like, these kind of headbands. <coughs> so I have those. And then up here I just have a little mirror. And then I have this box that says my name. And then in it I just have like mini applicators for eyeshadow. Oh jeez. Okay. And then. Up a little. I'll make these sneak out of the way. Um, <coughs> this is just, I don't, I don't really know what it's used for. But I got it in. At big lot, uh, probably just like that. I got it at big lots as well. And I'm with this is just like a mini thing of Vaseline, if you guys can tell. And this is like I got it. My mom went to a Tupperware party and she got me it. It's just a little thing of Tupperware. I don't even have anything in it. So tell me what I should put in it, please. Uh, then I have I'm featuring my um uh Project Pan products up here, so I remember to bring them. I have uh three or er, five lip glosses and four other products. So <clears throat> I have those. And then we move over to the other side. No, first let's go in the middle. Okay. So oh geez, you're never gonna be able to see Oh hey, you can see it. I'll put this down too. Okay. So wrong way. Okay. 
So in here, I just have my single eyeshadow. Uh, jeez. Okay, so like I said, I just have my single eyeshadow. Um, this is not working out for me. I cannot wait to get my camera back. Okay, <clears throat> but I have some color tattoos, some... I got things from Sephora, and some random ones, and some bare mineral ones. <coughs> and then I have these elf, like, I drew on one of them, but... Just these elf little, like, compacts, and then I have refills for all of them. They are all look the same, they're all the same exact color. Um... Then I just have one of these, which I think I got this at Walgreens, and I just put on it again. Um, then I have, wrong well, link. Okay, I have all my hair accessories. Like I have my bump it and some other clips and body pads. Then here I have my hair ties and some other, uh, you can't see, and some other clips. <coughs> Then back here I have all my eyeshadow, um, like, little mini, whatever they're called. I forgot what they're called. <laughs> Comment below, what are they called? But then I just have some of these, and then some more elf. I want to say compact, but that's not the word. <laughs> I forgot. And then here I have all my makeup, oh jeez. I have all my makeup cleaners and makeup remover products have some Clinique, some, oh, I also have my acne treatments in here, and then this. In this bin, I have all of my lip glosses. Okay, not all of them. Okay, and here I have all my lip glosses, which I don't actually have that many. <coughs> but I have things from Avon. And Bath and Body Works, Elf, and more Bath and Body Works, Sephora. Um, got the new L'Oreal like lip, uh, liquid lip stain. Uh, I got a chubby stick or not a chubby stick, but a Revlon just bit and kiss though. Chubby sticky thing, and I drew on it with purple marker. Um, they just have some Victoria's Secret and some more elf at the bottom. No, oh, you can't see. Yeah, now you can see better. Okay. And then the next thing in the Nico, I have all my lipstick. Um, but first I have just a Burt's Bees thing and a lip, a lip style, I think it's called. I don't know. Leave a video response if you know how to pronounce it. Okay. And then I don't, like I said, I don't have that much makeup, so I don't have a lot of lipsticks. I just have like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight lipsticks. But, um, I have a lot more at my dad's house because that's where I keep the majority of my makeup. But I just have a Clinique uh, lipstick, and, and it's so pretty. It just looks like that. And it's in Glazed Berry. Uh, then I have some Color Whispers, and I actually have like 10 of these at my dad's house. Can't see. This just been Lust for Blush. And I actually did a review on these versus the Lip Butter. And again, I have like five more of these at my dad's house, and this is in Lollipop. Um, then I just have this really weird thing, and it's a really ugly lipstick, but it just looks like that. And it's by MF. What the crap does MF mean? My mom gave me it. Then I just have a Sephora lipstick, and it just looks like that. I have the Super Stay 24 Hour Lipstick by Maybelline. Okay, this stuff does not, it stays on for a long time, but the nude one turns up blue. Like after like 20 minutes, it turns your lips blue. And that is in beige, forehead hood or something. 
I don't know. Um, then I just have a cover girl lipstick in the shade 295 Rich. And this random lipstick, which I'm sorry you guys cannot see, like, I knew I got it. Okay. Um, now I see a big, ginormous thing. And I think I'll actually be able to take my computer. So there it goes. Okie dokie. First we're going to start off with this jar, which you guys can't really see. But in here I just have all my brushes and combs and... <clears throat> yeah, my brushes and combs. Okay. And then... In here I just got these at Claire's. I have some earrings and a little lock with a key on it. And a little ring. And then here's my makeup carousel, which holds most of my makeup. And yeah, it just spins really smoothly and nicely, and there's a lot of storage. So, first, I'll start off with the brushes. I just have some lip brushes, some eye brushes, some elf, like that, some mascara brushes. Why is this in here? Okay. Um, some foundation and eyebrow brushes. I think I already said that. Lip brushes. And yeah. Then in here I have that should be in there. That should be in there. In here I have most of my face brushes or the things I use for my face, like my conceal okay. My concealer brush. Uh my concealer brush. And then my bare minerals brush. Just this random brush which I actually use for blending under my eyes another random brush, which I actually did mention this in my March favorite. An e.l.f. professional blush brush, which I actually don't like. Because e.l.f. brushes, like the studio ones are really scratchy. The ones with the um, red, like, um, bristles. Another random brush. <coughs> and a total face brush by e.l.f. And then an e.l.f professional foundation brush, which broke, <gasps> yeah, okie dokie, so then, I'll just move right here, um, I have my eyelash curler, my mascaras, which, my mom says I have a lot, but I truly don't think I have a lot, so here's all my just normal mascara, or no, I have my clear mascara in there too, but I have cover girl, like the clear stuff, the uh, Voluminous Million Lashes Diamonds. I don't know what brand this is by though. Uh, Maybelline Falsies, which I actually love. I did have the waterproof one, and that one was, you got so much product on the brush, it just sucked. Uh, <clears throat> Great Lash, which I actually had two of those, but I lost the other one. Uh, Sky Rise by NYC. And I just have a Clinique Lash Doubling Mascara. And I actually use this for where I, <clears throat> when I wear my fake lashes, but I only wear those for dance because I absolutely hate them. Um, then I just have a tweezers and some replacement pads for my eyelash curler. Ow. Then I have two liquid mascaras, or eyeliners, two liquid eyeliners. Um... And I just have my eyeliner. I have Neutrogena Nourishing Eyeliner. It looks like that. And this actually, like, sucks. Like, you wear it and it smudges so bad. But this one is worse. It's Maybelline Define a Line. Whatever you do, do not buy this. I have to show you a swatch of it. Okay, so that's what it looks like. And I mean, just by looking at it, I can already tell that it's, like, really soft. Well, you put it on, and it just goes on so soft. Looks like that. But then, all you gotta do is go like that, and it smears. Like, okay, yeah. Not happening. That's from smearing it four times. So, and my hands are dry. Like, it's not like they're wet. So, with your eyes watering and stuff, good luck with that. And then, also, the Maybelline New York uh, Unstoppable Eyeliner. 
This one, I don't really like either. It just kind of looks like that. And you just put it on, and it actually goes on kind of rough. And once again, you go like that. It doesn't do it as bad, but it definitely does it. Um, they had two physician formula ones, and I actually had three. I actually had a black too, but I lost it. And I use this every single day, almost. Well, almost. But this one, and I also have purple one. But this one just so, 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 so nice. You put it on. Oh, geez, I kind of smashed it on. You put it on, and it's like that. And you can rub it. And nothing happens. Like, it still looks the same. Let's try to rub it more. Okay, it smudged a little more. But that's it. So, yeah. <clears throat> Let me just pop these all back in there. Sorry, this video is so long. <laughs> okay. I dropped something. I just hit my head up. My bookshelf. Oh yeah, and uh <coughs> this one over here, guys haven't if you can tell it was a bookshelf. Okay, and then onto the bottom I just have my L'Oreal, which I know I mentioned in my mouth. Oh you guys can't see it. Okay, first I just have the L'Oreal True Match stuff, which I absolutely love. And I have the Magic Smooth Souffle. I have just a blush that's ridiculously pink, which I never wear. Um, powder compact, some sponges, and some sheer cover, which I actually love this thing. I only use it when I travel, though, because it's, like, brand new. just comes with two um, concealers. And then, oh, my God, why does this always happen? And then a powder concealer on the bottom. So yeah, there's that. And then there's the last little drawer. And this is all liquid foundations. I have the Revlon Nearly Naked, which I can't wear because it looks like my face is a different color than my neck. So I'll have to wait until summer. <coughs> then I just have, these say tester on them, but I don't know why because I bought them in their boxes and then they said tester. But when I went to bring them back, they wouldn't accept them back. But I just have the L'Oreal uh, New True Match Super Blendable Makeup. Yeah, and again, if I wear this one, this is the lightest one. It looks like I'm wearing like a different face color. <clears throat> then I just have I have some CoverGirl and Olay Tone Rehab Two in One Foundation Base just looks like that. It actually smells really weird, but it's a really light consistency. It's not heavy at all. This actually isn't foundation, but it's the e.l.f. Eyelid Primer. I have, which I love this, the Revlon Color Stay Under Eye Concealer SPF 15. This works amazing. I use it every day. Then I have the L'Oreal New True Match Super Blendable Concealer, but it's different than this one because there's a little, like, pink brush on it. It's weird. But this one matches my skin tone, but the rest of them don't. So yeah, that is my makeup collection, and I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I hope you guys are having a great day at school, because I know that most of you guys are probably already at school, unless you guys have a delay. But I'll see you guys in my next video. Comment, subscribe, and I'll see you later. Bye!